Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Dwarf Fortress Adventure Mode. Last time we had a reasonably successful character, but no audio. Sorry about that. The house was a bit loud, so I just didn't bother recording it. And I don't have game audio anyway, as you've probably noticed from the first few episodes. Anyway, if I remember correctly, we got ambushed by goblins. Proceeded to murder them, then we killed a vampire, drank his blood and became a vampire, and now we killed a cheetah. And I'm not sure to what purpose, but, you know, apparently it was terrorizing the town people or something. Who knows? But it's dead, and our job is done. So, where to now? Do we have another quest? Nope. What's that, though? Hey, we do. Kill Mata Blunt Bulwark. Er, okay, let's go try to kill Mata Blunt Bulwark, shall we? This character actually got pretty lucky with the starting gear. We had like a steel axe, which is pretty much the best we could ask for. It's, unless you make stuff for yourself in fortress mode, it's actually the best you can get. I feel uneasy. Why? Am I being attacked by more like dingoes or something? Is that an eagle? Um, yep, that's an eagle. That's an unharmed eagle. Can we... No, we don't feel safe enough to travel. Of course we don't. Oh, another cheetah. We just killed a legendary one of you. I'm sure you're not going to be an issue. Yeah. Nice try. Moving on. Uh, looks like we'll have to... Ooh. Ah, good. There's a crossing over here. Mm, I was hoping we would get there before nightfall. Let's see how poorly this goes. Let's try to sleep until daylight. It won't work, but we can try. Huh, no cackling, just uneasy. Hello? Things that want to murder us, where are you? What are you, Jaguar? Yeah, Jaguar. Well, let's hit you. Missed. Didn't we? No. We severed apart. Good. Now, let's. Vessel, Jaguar, arm. Because we haven't actually eaten in a while, so we're actually painfully close to, I don't know, if vampires actually die from thirst, but you know, they might. Um, nestle a jaguar, choke jaguar. Triangle Jaguar. Is it dead? No. It's on the ground, stunned and winded. But not knocked out, so... Yeah, it's knocked out. We can... We eat Jaguar. We eat more Jaguar. Let's just eat Jaguar until it either dies or... Is it going to die? Okay, I'm tired. Let's just... And I'm strangling it to death. I didn't mean to originally, but yeah. Now that we're on this path, let's go with it. Because wrestling experience. Let's see, where's our wrestling? Um, yeah, we've already leveled up our wrestling quite a bit just by strangling that one jaguar. So definitely could have gone worse. Let's try this again and see what wakes us up this time. Cackling, of course. Well, let's start heading towards our target. While we try to outrun these fools. At least we passed away a good chunk of the night before they started to bother us. So we should be fine-ish. Could also just hide out in the water. I don't think they can swim. 
Most things in this game can't swim unless they're actually... What did that say? Vanish. Unless they're actually, like, from the water. Which is handy, actually, if you're trying to escape something. Also keep in mind, however, that most characters can't... How the fucking way can't swim either, so... You know. Risk assessment. Sometimes it's a good idea to hide in the water. Most of the time, not too much. Dawn is already breaking. I'm just getting sick of these fools. Okay, what's our mortal wound look like? Um, yeah, we should be fine. Just walk around until the sun comes up. There's the camp. Yeah, um, one thing that I don't think I noticed, noted, even though I'm a vampire, the game will still mark wounds that would normally kill, like, a proper adventurer as mortal wounds, even if we are in no actual danger of the wound. Hey, we're here to kill you, Madam Blunt Bulwark. Prepare to die. Oh, I certainly am. Look surprised by the frosty of my onslaught, and we showered the bone through the left min. Okay. Yeah, we came with the flat of our axe, so blunt damage. And now we hacked off his foot. Cool. And I hacked off his arm. To my artery. He's pretty well dead. off a foot. Miss. He misses too. Miss. He misses. Tearing apart the liver. Okay, that seems relatively fatal. Oh, our thing moved. Um, caught a foot. Let's step away from that fool now and try to take out this flashy one. Attack, and we cut off a leg. Ooh, that's pretty good. We punch, why are we punching? Do we not have our axe? Now we have our axe, we have a shield. Where did our shield go? Um. I don't know where our shield went. Oh, is that on the ground over there? Nope, left a sock. I don't know what happened to our shield. Probably should have paid more attention to that. So we should be able to kill this guy without too much damage. Ooh. What did we... Just got teeth flying all over the fucking place. That's wonderful. And... Fracture the bone, tear muscle, and liver. And he's dead. Cool. Now, finish you off. Let's see. Left your morning star. Oh, shield. I think I'll take that. And it's in our bag, so we move. shield. Oh yeah, I forgot we kept the fucking cheetah's tail. It's a nice trophy. Um, take a pouch. Nothing else of interest. Do you have anything nice? You have a better shield. Let's grab that. Drop. Oh, we're just wielding two shields. That works too. Anything else of interest? Bag. I don't know why I always collect the bags. I just like to have bags around for some reason. Oh, this fool's still alive. Okay, I'm done looting your friend, so let's deal with you now. Huh. That didn't go very well for you. 
Halberd. I think Halberd uses the axe skill, but I like our axe better. Fire pouch. Anything else? We should probably get like a. Where'd he go? A trophy of some sort. Do you have any interesting bits or pieces around? Leg, corpse. No, really. Let's take one of your teeth. Yeah, let's take your tooth. And we can't travel while we're in the camp. Is there anything else here before we leave? Or anyone else here, rather? It's east by southeast, it sounds. Oh, so this is a relatively small camp, even for a bandit camp. Kinda hoping we find something? Anything? No. Okay, well, let's go back to town and, you know, show them our tooth and our tail. And no, you don't actually have to, like, show them any proof that you did your job. You can just claim it and they'll be like, oh, we believe you, because nobody would ever lie. Ever. Especially about an adventure. I don't know why they are so trusting, but... You know, whatever. Game logic, I suppose. What are you? Fortress? Fortress. I don't think we need you right now. We do, however, need... this here. I like how these cities look at night. I like blue coloring. I don't know if, um, bogeymen can actually spawn in a, like, proper city. I think they fade away if they even chase you into one, though, so... Okay, where are the buildings? Wow, all my CPU's like having a heart attack from this. Here, let me just slide that down. Yeah, I see. Between the recording software and the game itself, my CPU is having a bit of a fit. Hey, people. Cool. Come on. Sleepy people. But people. Let's wait till dawn. Sleep. Come on. Hello. Uh, you can let me stay here for the night. Thank you. And sleep until dawn. You don't actually need to sleep as a vampire. You won't get like tired or anything, but it's a way to pass the time. Ooh, are you all awake now? Apparently. Hey, you're a trapper. Guess what I did. Yes, it is fantastic. Are you a night creature? No, that sucks. Will you join me? Uh, well, I suppose that's true. Goodbye. Um, the early birds. Do either of you have weapons? Hey, a ranger. Rangers usually hunt, which usually means they have some weapon skill. Um, ah, there it is. I'm stupid. Okay, do you have a job for us? Outlaw. Most Sloshed? Most sloshed. So apparently these bandits are very drunk. Travel to the northwest and kill the warlord. Okay, I'll try it. First I want to get a s snack. Anybody awake in here? Yes. That sucks. I was kind of hoping I, hoping I could like snack on your sleepy peoples, but... Oh. Guess not. 
So, where's this place? Is it that one up farther north? Yeah. It's on the other side of a river, though. This place is just flooded with rivers, actually. I totally did not mean the pun there, but I'm happy it happened. Let's see if we can find a way there. Without swimming, preferably, but not holding my hopes up too much for that. Luckily we're vampires, so we no longer have to breathe. Just handy. Hey, it's not even surrounded by rivers. Cool. <coughs> oh, west by northwest. Oh, yeah. So this is a pretty hilly area, actually. Oh, there you are. Moral solid. Okay, hit hunter. Prepare to die. Where are you? Yeah. Do you have any ranged attackers with you? You have bags. That's not useful. That looks like a spearman and a lasher. And more bags, another spear dude. Yeah, you've got lots of dudes, but none of them seem to have like ranged weapons. So didn't do much of anything. We tore his cheek a bit. Let's hit that lasher. An artery. Oh, here's a warlord. And we cut off the arm. Tore apart the lung. He should suffocate pretty soon then. Uh, strike him with the pommel. Surprise him. Tear apart muscle tissue and nerves on his arm. That's handy. Human lasher bled to death. Wow, there's a lot of them. It's more than I thought. Shatter the bone with the flat of our axe. Turning apart the muscle and spilling his guts. Ew. Okay, well, he's not look going to live much longer. Tear apart the spleen. Jamming the skull through the brain and killing him very quickly. Okay, is that everyone? Looks like. So, there's a spear. Whip. I like that whip, but we have no skill to use it. Mm. Sock and sandal. Pike. Take his pouch. This is where our friend here died, the one we came to kill, isn't it? No? Oh, did we not kill him? Did he actually, like, stagger off? Yeah, he totally did. Come back here. Your lung is torn apart. How have you not suffocated? There. Now he's properly dead. Nice flail. Oops. Do we not have a... Oh, there you go. Ouch. Let's see if we can find a Ah, really? There's more of you? Severed his foot. Miss. Came with our shield and broke his bone. And dead. What'd you have on you? Nice mace. And some coins. Alright, here's where the fight proper was. What's this? No, I think that's the wrong person's bits. Um, we didn't really cut anything off of this one though, did we? Mm, I think we can miss a trophy. Mm, let's get out of here. Can't travel until we leave the site. Oh. Oh, 
done. Can I travel now? Yes, I can. Huh. Well, looks like a mountain home up there. Over, um, here. I don't know if we can actually go there or not. And by that, I mean, we can actually get to that spot on the map, but I don't know if mountain homes have been properly implemented yet, or if it's just an empty map. Because I know not even, like, just a few versions ago, they weren't implemented yet, and I don't know if he's fixed that yet. Let's try to pass the time until we can see again. I might try that out actually, but yeah, let's see if we can run there, because it's not too far. We need to get the fuck out of here anyway. Game? Thank you. Oh, I'm in a martial trance, because of all the... <sighs> all these overly happy bastards here. What's this? Okay. Well, we're gonna try it. The game will catch up. Come on. You can do it. Yep. Um apparently it was all deflected, but Oh, it froze over. No wonder. So we can't really get out of here now, can we? This may have been a poor decision. Yeah, we totally can't get out of here. Well, oh, let's search our way out. Like this one. So apparently the rivers freeze around here. Um, you can't actually run out of bogeymen like this. Like they will just keep spawning until one, until either you die or. The world, you know, what am I saying? Until the sun comes up. There we go. Those are the words I want. I apparently cannot words today. So, what did that say? Oh, Bogeyman banished. Yeah, if you get too far away from them, they seem to just give up. But more of them just spawn in anyway, so it's not really a big deal. Like so. North by Northwest now. Go away. I don't like you in particular. I do, however, like being able to move. Let me move. Game. Oh. That's why I got stuck on. Never mind, I'm just dumb. Hmm. you men are disappearing and slamming into obstacles and all sorts of shit. They're just generally annoying me. Where is this mountain home? Go away. Travel now. Oh, we're way the fuck away from it. That's why. It's a lot closer on the map. Mm -hmm. Fine, we'll just cross the river because it's probably gonna go all the way up into the fucking mountain. So, might as well. I think the, I think it would definitely be better if you could cross rivers, like, yes, yeah, so now I discovered a river. That's why we stopped traveling along the map. I think it would be better if you could actually just, like, cross rivers properly. This one's frozen over, too. 
but I suppose it's not really an option. Let's find a way out from here. Yeah, I didn't think that was working. Come on. This is like a giant moat around the mountain home or something. This, this is kind of ridiculous. There we go. And it probably let us out on the wrong side of the river, didn't it? Maybe. I'll have to find out. Travel away from the river. I'm trying to travel away from the river. How far away from this river do we have to be? Um, here? No. No? No. How about now? Hmm? Thank you. Mm. Let's just try to get this sun up. Because I can't see if we're running into another river or not. Um, um, why did I come back down here? I don't know. Apparently to get attacked by something. What are you thing that's attacking me? You remember the mint wraiths when we are finished with you. Oh, goblins. Neat. Overboard. With a cross. So, who? Well, yes, yes, prepare to die. I gotcha. It's not terrible because we don't really need our internal organs as badly as we used to, which is an odd statement, but we don't. So, getting hit by a crossbow bolt isn't actually as big of a deal anymore. Because the big problem with them is they have a habit of cutting apart internal organs. You know, like we just did to this fool. We cut off its leg. Why am I latching on firmly? Don't latch on. Attack. I have a decent shot at his body. Attack. And... Tore apart muscle and spilled his guts. Her guts. To her. Sorry. Um... Are you dead? Yes, you're dead. And your friend's probably dead. And your friend's dead. Is that all of you? So, let me grab a cloak. Where? Cloth. I don't think I need a loincloth. I don't think I want one that's used by a goblin anyway. It's a nice cap, but I like that hood more. Wear hood. And let's just start burning stuff. Did we get burned at all? No, we're just a bit... I don't feel safe enough to travel. There's more of them? Well... No? I don't see any more. Oh, there's you. Um, anything interesting on you? Another tunic? Hmm... Take another cloak. Now can I go? Yes. Good. Yeah, we're getting close. So where's this mountain home? More? Over the river again, I guess. 
don't even know if they're actually implemented. Mm, one sec. Okay, I've okay, got time. Just try not to lose another recording session because that was really obnoxious. What are you? Mm, must have been a bird, I guess. Better just like, got eaten into the water. That's why no, I'm supposed to be heading south anyway. Herp -derp. Hey, the water's not frozen for once. That's a start. What are you? Is that a bear? Are you a bear? And another bear? No, you're boars. Well, I'm kind of hungry. I'll eat a boar. If I can catch a boar. Come back here, boars. Aren't you supposed to be aggressive or something? Like. We kind of heard it. So, where's your throat? You have a throat, right? Pretty sure boys have throats. Yes, they do. Good. Chip boar, chip boar, chip boar, chip boar. Eat boar. Eat boar. No, that's battle axe. Boar's dead. Okay, well, I licked my axe on accident. But, you know, whatever. This kind of thing happens. I don't know why this kind of thing happens, but, you yeah, know, it does. Oh, now we're taking a bath. Unexpected, but welcome. Let's get away from this river before the game yells at us more for trying to travel near a river. Apparently doesn't like that. Okay. Okay, I'm not seeing a mountain home. Yeah, I'm definitely not seeing a mountain home. I guess there is no mountain home here. That's disappointing. Can I go in this tunnel? No. Oh well. I mean, that's all for this session, guys. We'll be back with this character probably next time. I don't know when. I don't have a schedule or anything. Bye.